back to another video here on my channel. In today's video, we are going to be doing the part two to the Realistic House series. So if you didn't watch part one, I would definitely recommend watching part one because you will not be able to do anything that we're doing in this episode. So if you want this house, you gotta do part one, obviously. So uh, let's stop talking and let's get into it. So um we're just gonna finish the front of the house now and then we'll probably work our way on the side and maybe the roof if we get to it i don't know i don't want the video to be too long but let's get out our smooth sandstone and let's also get out our smooth sandstone slab we're gonna finish these steps right now um so we're just gonna put two right in front of the door just like that pretty easy and then with this, we're just going to extend this out by one, just like that. And we're going to put one, two, three, four. So it gives this little patio protrusion thing. I don't know what you would want to call it, but yeah. All right. So now after we have done that, you are going to want to grab your brick. You're also going to want to grab your pillared quartz. So we're just going to bring the pillared quartz. We're just going to line it like this with the brick. You can grab your smooth quartz and do this also. It's just going to come out one from the brick. So it's going to be brick, quartz, boom. Uh, and then after you do that, um, it doesn't matter. You can do it down here. You can do it up here. It's probably going to get, it's going to get, it's not probably, it is going to. It's going to get cut off by the roof, so it doesn't matter. So we're going to take this out by six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'd recommend just putting a block behind here so it's easier. So you can do that. Doesn't matter what block it is, it's not gonna be seen. So and then we're just gonna fill it on up all the way up to the roof. So let's do that. And same thing, we're just gonna line it with that uh the quartz once we get to the top. So we get to the top, we're going to line it up and you can bring it. You don't have to go out one like you have to do with these. So just do that. So what we are going to do now is we are going to start the roof to this. So grab your polished blackstone stairs and you can also grab your polished blackstone slab. So this is probably the easiest way. We're just going to go with the flow how it is here. and. Uh, we'll go back and we'll fix everything that we have to so just bring it on up like this and all the way up to the top like so bring it on up same thing here bring it on up and when you get to this part instead of it being a stair we're going to put you can just stack two of the slabs and make a full block like that and then just put a slab right there like that after you have done that, we are going to just do this. So, one, you can break this block, do one there, break this block, one there. So, now you have the roof to this part, and then all we're going to want to do is break this and break that. So, you get this little roof thing going on here. And, yeah. So now you should have something looking like this and we should be good. So let's just add the little details and we're going to work on the right side of the house and we'll get to this side later. Um, so because the right side's way easier. I just want to get that out of the way. So you're going to get your blackstone wall this time and you're also going to get birch, um, a birch sign. So get a birch sign and these walls are going to represent like uh like lights so you're gonna put one here in the middle and it's gonna be on the second one down from the window and then same thing over here put one right there and then same place but put a sign in the middle so it should look like that if you get the gist so we're gonna do the same thing except over by the front door this time so it's gonna be on the second one boom same thing over here boom so you should have something like that. So now after you have that, we are going to work on this side of the house. So you have the front done. We'll come 
excuse me we'll come back and we will um we'll we'll add all the details and stuff like the, the granite and make it all we'll spruce it up later but let's work on the side right now so we're gonna come out 35 from the front including the front so one that's gonna be one and then two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine thirty thirty one thirty two thirty three thirty four thirty five so you're gonna come out thirty five and um we are going to Let's get our pillared quartz. Get your pillared quartz out. And we're just going to bring this up to just a random... Actually, no. Not a random. What am I talking about? We are going to bring this up 17 now. So, this is actually... We're technically going to go up 16. So, 1, and then 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16... So then it should line up with this, if I am not mistaken. So after you do that, you can just bring it over and connect it just to make sure. Just like that. Actually, yeah, see? So should connect. So you should make a box just like that. And after you make a box, let's do the peak to the roof. So the easiest way of doing this is just going up so like that boom 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 and once we like you can just guesstimate how far you think you've went and whenever you think you've went too far or far enough then we can go to the other side and same thing over here let's get the uh the smooth quartz and let's stick that out by one just like the front and then after you have done that we're gonna go up same thing and we're just gonna try and meet these in the middle so they're going to meet in the middle but we have to find that because i did not actually count how many this is so let's see all right i guess my guess was very good because it's literally the exact middle so you should now have it boxed off you should have the peak and yeah so what we are going to do now is we are going to do the fireplace this this side of the house is the easiest besides the back like this is super super easy so what we are going to do is we have one so one two three four so it's gonna be three sideways one up now this is going to be where the chimney is going to be so it's gonna go six now so you're gonna come out one with the stone and it's gonna go one two three four five six so six out and then you can just bring these up and this could be random but this one it's gonna be it has to be 24 tall so Including this bottom, it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So, same thing. I guess I'm really good at guessing today. So, same thing. And then you can just box it off like this. And then we're just going to double it up. So doesn't really matter how far down you go but just make sure you go down far enough to where it's going to be the roof is going to cover it so like that and then same thing you can just line it sideways like this and then this should be good just to where the roof is going to be hiding it and then now we can just fill it all the way up like this fill it on up and like if you guys I don't know if I'm gonna do like a, a full 
yard like a front yard and a backyard but if you guys do want to see that tell me in the comments like tell me if you want to see like a backyard like with a pool and a deck and like all that stuff because i can do that but i just it wasn't in the plans but if you guys do want all that extra stuff then i will do it if you want me to so you fill that up once you have this filled up you are going to want to grab your light gray carpet and we're going to do one, two, three, four, same thing, one, two, three, four. And then right in the middle, you can take your smooth quartz and just put them up like that. And you should have the chimney now done. And now all we're going to do is we're just going to fill in this wall. Same thing with the peak. And um, yeah, so before I fast forward, I'll just show you what to do with the peak because you guys might get confused so with this it should look like this when you're filling it make sure make sure it doesn't come out like this because see when we go to do the roof it's not gonna work because this is gonna be in the way and we can't just like you know, you, 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 yeah you know what I mean so we can't do that so what we are going to do is it's gonna go two two it, it should go up by twos so two 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 you understand so um, I'm gonna go fill this all in same thing you fill it in even over here fill this all in with sideways pillar quartz and I will meet you guys back here when I am done and you are too have this wall all filled in it should look a little like this it's supposed to be flat so just ignore that so now once you have it looking like this um it should look like this over here see how it goes up two 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 you see it's like an l shape with the roof it should look like that because we don't want it sticking out because then it looks weird so that's what it should look like and other than this there's only one window on this so we're gonna add that one window real quick so it's gonna be five or it's gonna be six blocks up and it's gonna be uneven so you're gonna find the middle which is the middle of the peak and we're gonna just find where that is and we're gonna go over two so one two so once you're over two we're gonna go one so that's one two three four five six and then on the seventh block you're gonna break it like that and we're gonna put a window here so it's gonna be five tall so break two so then the middle should be right there it should still be there and then next to it to the left is where the window is gonna be so we're gonna break up five now so that's one two three four five and then same thing so you should have a two by five or a five by two um so that is what you should have we're going to do the same thing we did with the front windows so you're going to take your iron trap door line it line it and then two from the top and we're gonna do that and then just to get this out of the way you can grab your black stained glass and you just fill up the back of it because this is the only window on this side so we don't have to worry about that so that's pretty simple i mean that's pretty much all it is for this side of the house it should just be the window and it just should be flat so now we are going to make our way over to the back of the house so this should be 26 
long as well as the front so it should line up with the front so we're going to take our stone again and we're going to go 26 including this one so one two three four five six seven let me just make sure this is right so yeah seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six so it should come out twenty six with the stone you're gonna take your pillar quartz and we're gonna go right up so we're gonna go up like this and we're gonna meet uh we're gonna meet these so we're gonna just come from here box it off like so let me bring this up box it off like that so it should just be a big old box pretty uh pretty easy so after you have done that we are going to grab our smooth quartz slab and you can just bring it over like that so now the back the main part of the back is starting to take shape and before we do anything else let's let's just make the peak over here too so we have like a full roof you know what i mean so just do the same thing we did over there and it should be easier because now we have a roof line so we can just match it up so just bring it up to where the uh middle is and then when you bring it back down it should line up with the front so bring it on up to there, to there, and then we're going to just make sure this is correct, so we're just going to bring this across, and it is correct, and now we're just going to bring it right back down, so just bring it on down, this house is very simple, the only Part that's really not simple is sort of the left side like where the garage doors are in the front the front is definitely the hardest part of this house but if you are this far in the video we pretty much have the hardest part of the house done so that's good so it should come down and meet like that so now we have our main roof line done so before we get any further let's work on the back so we are going to come out three so including this block it's going to be three so one two three and then you can just bring this all the way down because this is where the windows are going to sit so bring it out three and we're going to bring this up by six this time so one two three four five six and then just make it like that so then it is three wide so then after you've done that you can go up one more so technically seven if you want to call it that and there's really no destination for this I mean you can bring it all the way down just so you have a general idea but once you've done that this is where the hard part is so what we're gonna want to do is you're just going to want to make it to where these are sideways and there's a gap of two in between and we're going to do three of these windows so you see how it's two for the window and then it's a sideways pillar so in order to get that sideways you have to place it in like that and then on next to it so it looks like that so in order to do that we're going to do this uh like that and then same thing one more time just bring this up and then you can place it like that or if you want to make it easier on yourself, you can always just fill it all up and then you can break out the gaps, but I'm um, hard, so you can do it my way or you can just fill it up, it, it doesn't matter. So once you have done that, we are going to take our smooth quartz, you should have three of these windows after doing that. Um, that uh, it, you could, it could be hard for you, it could not, I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's all you want to do is make three windows, should be a, should be a six by two. And after you do that, we're going to go up four. So one, two, three, four. And then on the fourth one, you're going to want to put a slab. So it should be four full blocks. There shouldn't be any half blocks. So four full blocks. And on the fifth, put a slab. So it's still four. And then you're just going to want to put a slab on top. So then it looks like a full block, but it's really not. It's just two halves. 
So you're gonna want to do that, and you're just gonna do that for the other two windows. So just do that, like so. Nope, like that. So now you should have that type of window going on, and we're just gonna get our trap door, iron trap doors out, and we're gonna do the same thing we did with the other windows. We're just gonna uh, do these in the middle, like that. So now you should have these windows done. So these three windows should be done, and um, we're just gonna do uh, the top window now. So this is gonna go up three. So uh, so this is one. So you can do two, and then you can do three. Then same thing. It's gonna come out three over here also. So it's gonna be one, two. One two, one two, one two, one two. So remember, this is this counts as the third. So two sideways, one up. So now we're gonna do the same thing as we did down here with the sideways, except only once. So I'm just gonna get one of these sideways in the middle, and then you can do it again for here also, like that. So you should have that. And now let's fill this up right here so it's like that so we should have a four by two like so so it should be three and then four and then two and then the slab is like on the second block so after you have that same thing that we've been doing put these in the middle to separate your windows like that and then after that you can just fill it on up like this this is just gonna be flat there isn't gonna be windows uh, on the second floor for this part of the house right here but once we get to the other parts there will be so fill that up and then there's going to be a window here also so we're gonna come out seven so this counts as one so one two three four five six seven and then let's just do let's just make this easy so instead of coming out seven let's just fill this on up actually and then we can poke out the holes because this is i'm doing it the hard way i'm sorry he did not mean to do it the hard way but i should have just made it a flat wall and then put out the or put the windows in but too late now um so now we're gonna come out seven so one two three four five six seven and then on the eighth block put a hole after you put the hole you're gonna go two put one more put two so then you should have two windows and then we're gonna go four so one two three four so it should be a four by two same thing right here four by two and then like i said trap doors trap doors trap doors trap door so it separates the window into that thing so now the main part of the house is done now we just have to do the garage part and once we get the garage part done i mean it's pretty easy from there on it's just like yeah it's pretty easy so um let's do that all right sorry for the cut um i noticed i was doing something wrong so i didn't put it in because i completely realized when i was doing it so we're gonna come out two here and then we're gonna put a stone so should be at the corner so we're gonna go out two so one here and then one here and then put a stone on the third block and we're gonna bring this over seven so one two three four five six seven and then you can just bring your pillar quartz up and meet it right here so we can just bring this right there and just meet it oh hey now let's not do that and just meet it right there so then you should have it boxed off like that and then you can just uh go like this you can bring this over like that and you just do that and make sure to stick it out one because like we've been doing the roof line that's where the roof line's gonna go so with this just fill it on up like we have And then there's going to be a window up here. Crap. Nope, nope, 
nope, nope, nope. Oh wow, I cannot fail to save my life. Alright, so we have this all filled up now. Alright, now we do. Alright, we have this all filled up now. So what we are going to want to do is we're gonna be two from the side and two from the top. So one, two, and then this counts as one, right? So then two. So then right here we're gonna go one, two, and oop. There should be three. So two and then this counts as another one. So three. So well, we're just gonna bring this down four. So one, two, three, four. So like that. So now you have this window. And then like we've been doing, nothing new. Put the little thing in the middle. And uh, there you go, you got your window. So now we got this window here. So um I'm just gonna stop here. And we'll finish the back and we'll finish the garage and probably the roof on the next video because I don't want this video to be too long because I, I have a feeling it is because we finished the front and all the rest. So um, we'll finish the back on the next video and we'll also finish the garage most likely and maybe the roof. I'm hoping to get to the roof, but if we don't, that's okay. So if you guys did enjoy this video, please leave a like and subscribe. Uh, stay tuned for the next video that should come out tomorrow. And yeah, so if you guys did like leave this or if you guys did enjoy this video, please leave a like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.